The winner! Ah. Let me let go, let me dance! Lockdown season. Ah! Ah, Puka! <laughs> Guys, honestly, when I was watching this, even now I still feel nervous because yesterday that I was watching this when everyone was about announcing the result. I was so terrified. Although I knew Leko was going to be like it was obvious at you know to an extent like he had massive support from his fans like Tim Tim Dead not like all the celebrities they were supporting him and like it was crazy and he was going to win or like last year when it was Mike and Mercy when they were standing there I didn't know I I felt Mercy would win but I wasn't sure it was very nerve-wracking I was like what if Mike wins. What if Ebuka announces that uh, Mike uh, was the winner? It was crazy. I was really, really nervous. But this, all oh, and um, when it was Miracle and Sissy, God, that was crazy. That was the worst. I was so nervous. I, it was crazy because that was very, very tough. That decision was very, very tough. Like both of them, Sissy uh, uh, and Miracle, they're like huge contenders. For so I didn't really predict that. I. I felt anyone can win but last year Mercy and Mike I was also thinking maybe it can go both ways both of them they were amazing like both Mercy and uh, Mike they were awesome in the house but this year I was nervous but not like really nervous I knew uh, Leko was going to be like guys if you say that you didn't know Leko was going to win you are just joking if you've been watching the show and like if you are following what has been happening online on Instagram on Twitter it was obvious Leko was going to win but I was still nervous like anything that has to do with calling results I'm always nervous so I was really 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 really, really nervous when Luca was calling this one but I was like Lekon would win. But I, I was like, what if what if something crazy happens and it calls the writer as the winner? Guys, when um Nengi left, I wasn't surprised. People were surprised online. They were thinking that Nengi would be the one to stand there with Lekon. I felt it was going to be Dorati. I predicted I said Dorati would be the one like Nengi Nengi lost like so many fans and votes with the whole Ozo issue and everything that happened and I'm pretty sure people stopped like Nengi was like the most the campaign housemate housemate this year like people people were at first people loved her and because she didn't give them what they wanted she didn't give them the whole diva attitude and sassy and like she didn't fight with anyone she was just school like people like people love controversy she wasn't giving them that and I think that's why she lost so many fans so I knew Dorothy was going to be the one like Dorothy's fan that Dorothy's fan they are silent voters they won't make noise but before you know it they voted see how Dorothy although guys we'll talk about the social distancing after this let's talk about the social distancing like 60 percent like guys 60 percent like even if they joined the whole votes of other housemates it won't reach Lekon's own it was crazy but anyway let's keep reacting to it <laughs> Is oh oh Dorothy. I knew they won't call her, but I felt bad. I was like, oh god, this is. I was just imagining how how she would be feeling at that point. Dorothy, Dodo. I like her. She's cool. But I mean, <laughs> she can. Look how you're just smiling, God. <laughs> Other Guys, imagine if you are standing on this stage and just to be so. Uh, I don't even know how to explain it. Like all this, I've actually won something like this before when I contested for a pageant, like three pageants that I've won. I felt this way. The last one was Miss NYC. I was really, 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 really nervous before they announced the result. But to an extent, I knew my heart that maybe first or winner. Fit. Anyway, that's a story for another day. Let's continue. <laughs> If I can kiss on suspense. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on guys, it's just obvious. Duh, like I knew 
the call was going to win. It was obvious, like there was there was no denying that. But some part of my like my mind was like, what if something should happen? What if like there was a miracle voting and Dorothy imagines the winner? It's going to be crazy. There will be riots because Lakers fans are crazy. They don't they won't hear that. The icons, oh my god, it would have been it would have been a bloodbath. Like had it been able to say, Dorothy! It's going to be crazy. I just I just wish uh, like Abe can put like a prank or like he'll be like also people before you say it's a mistake and stuff like that or it's a joke. And guys, the video the video performed them. God guys Corona I hate you Guys, the video performed them and there was nothing like you know the excitement like, there was no the chance the, the noise like because there was no live audience, it was just the housemates. Even though they were shouting, two bears, ladders, like last year. Guys, remember last year? Oh my god, that finale was crazy. I mean, this year's finale, I think we have to attribute it like the whole, like, I don't know, I don't want to say it's boring or I don't want to say it's like bland, but it's just because of the corona, the COVID. The COVID spoiled everything, ruined everything. But I just thank God they actually pulled it off, like the whole BB Niger. They really tried to actually like whole big Niger, even with the COVID, it was amazing. They tried very, very well. And guys, I don't know, I'm thinking, I'll go for audition next year. <laughs> I'll go for Bibi Niger audition. I don't know, I want to go. Let me go for that audition. I know I'll have fun. I know if they will pick me. But if they don't pick me, I'll come back here and continue with my YouTube. <laughs> but anyway, guys, it was amazing. The finale was awesome. I just, I'm happy Lekong won. Like, the story is from like, um, the rejected, it's from his story like the rejected stone becoming the chief cornerstone. It, it was it was really heartwarming and touching. But I knew Lekong was going to win to an extent. It was just like effect factor what happened with effect in the former Bibi Niger. Well, I mean, apart from the whole pity factor and the whole sentiment like surrounding Lekong, he's very smart, he's intelligent. I saw that wow factor in him, the entertainment factor, I saw the G factor, the grace factor. He had everything going for him, so I was really, really happy for him that he won, and like he deserves it. And I just wish him well. I just wish he spends his money well, his future endeavors. Like all the housemates, the ex housemates, the evicted housemates. I just wish them well in whatever they're going to do. I wish them nice endorsements. I wish them like um, more money, uh, contracts, and stuff like that. I just wish them well in their future endeavors. <laughs> So guys, this is all I have for you today. I want to say thank you again for the support. Guys, please. I know that you and I just feel and so many people come and stand and subscribe. Please don't leave me. Don't unsubscribe from my channel, please. I'm working on bringing like exciting contents, amazing contents for you guys. Like I'll be bringing back to back contents. Like I'm not going to leave you guys. I won't bore you guys. Don't worry. Just keep subscribing, keep supporting my channel. I'll be bringing contents. I'm working on so many contents. Because like now that big night has been like everyone will start looking for things to do. Um, it was just like last year, so many people subscribed, so many people just very like engaging in contents, YouTubers content. Guys, and I understand that like for the past week we've been posting Big Niger contents, especially small channels and like upcoming YouTubers. It's because of the watch time and like the subscribe count so that we can actually monetize and it helped us I monetize because of Bibi Niger and everything. So I want to say thank you to Bibi Niger. <laughs> thank you to DSTV, Monty I don't know anyone, Ebuka, everyone, all the household. Thank you very much for everything for this amazing show. And thank you guys for everything. You guys are the real VIP, you are the MVP, you are the everything. You guys are the best. Thank you for the support. May God bless you all. May you guys get support when you need it. So guys, um, yeah, I'll go for this show. Even I do audition next year. <laughs> if it doesn't work, I'll come back with my channel. But so guys, this is all I have for you today. Congratulations, Lekon, once again. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. And I'll see you later with amazing content. Have a nice day ahead. Bye for now.